Hey yo boy, they call me Ice Prince, aka Ice Prince Amani from West Africa, Nigeria, and you're watching Glitterati on GH1. Don't touch it. You know what's up. Hello, my name is Shelly Frimpo Manso, and you're watching Glitterati on GH1. Keep watching. Welcome back from the break. You're still watching Glitterati, sponsored by Absolute Vodka. Last weekend, we witnessed the second annual Ghana DJ Awards 2014 held at the National Theatre on the 22nd of February. It was a colourful event which saw international celebrities such as DJ Jimmy Jat from Nigeria, DJ Rab from New York and DJ Divalish from South Africa. The night also saw great performances from the Discovery DJ of the Year, DJ Bright, and also DJ Slim from Kumasi, DJ Fo, Miss V, Hope Skinny, Diamond, AK Songstress and many more. I'ma tell you like it is, young fella. Stay in your place, square biz, young fella. Singing ain't all I do, young fella. So keep it moving right along, young fella. Don't don't get mad, cause 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 scales got girls showing him much, much else. Uh well I think that it's a very good initiative, a very laudable one. So I'm very happy to actually be a presenter for I think best discovery. And like he said, I'm expecting a very good show today. I want to be so impressed. I was also here last year. I think that there was a little hitches here and there. But from what I know and what I'm hearing, they have actually prepared very well for today's show. So. last year last year was amazing I'm expecting a better one you know a more amazing program because cause I know who put all this thing together I know the kind of person he is and I know what 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 he can put up when it comes to quality and also yeah I'm not I'm not here for just one of those awards I'm here for quality I'm here for an amazing show I'm here for a beautiful performance well I expect to see my man Mike Smith do something I expect DJ Black at least they walk away with something because he's been putting it down so long. This is the second edition and I'm expecting to see uh, so many great things, you know. We are celebrating our DJs and I, I feel uh, they deserve the best. And so that's the main reason I'm here. I'm here to support them, you know. I'm here to do performance from my heart. And after today, people will appreciate me and know the reason why I'm called the Aswatting Boy. Well, I think just like uh, in every process, we want to see an improved version. Last year was good. Of course, it had its own challenges. Uh, from the attendance so far, I think that tonight we're going to have a great time. So I'm looking forward to um, a good show. I'm looking forward to, um, you know, having a good time here, basically. Yeah, you know, so me is a DJ as well. So, you know, nothing, you know, so anytime I visit step on the stage, I real madness. So, you know, unique style, unique, unique performance always, you know. Tonight, DJ Awards. Yes, yeah, so. Are you performing? I'm performing. I'm tiptoeing on stage all the way. <laughs> and what's your fans expect from you tonight? The best, really. It's cliche, but the best, though.
looking at the DJ awards itself, do you think it's a good thing for um, awarding DJs in, in, in the country? Absolutely. I mean, DJs uh, are the people who make musicians who they are. And so um, if they don't sort of award DJs, I don't think it would be fair because it's always, you know, the Ghana Movie Awards, the Music uh, Awards. And it's, it's, it's the DJs who promote the musicians, you know, talk about movies and stuff like that. So, yes, it is good. And it's also to motivate them, you know, to do more, to be more professional and, and to be more entertaining. Um, you know, it's, um, I know it's going to be a step ahead as compared to what happened last year. And um, uh, expectations are so high as well. I have a whole lot of favorites in there, but I don't want to keep myself in the bias form, you know, because most of them are my friends. Most of them, I love what they're doing. But if you win or you lose, you're still out there. And uh, that's what I, I, I love to do. So that was it for the second annual Ghana DJ Awards. Next up, we have Glitz Personality, and by popular request, we are bringing back the sultry actress who's also a lawyer in the making, Karima Aguirre. the way you look you love fashion don't you well i i do but i'm not really the you're not really crazy about i'm not really it. crazy about well fashion. you always look good so people would assume well, yeah yeah, yeah well, you are, you know i'm so. more into shoes than clothes oh okay yeah, more so, into yeah. shoes how many pairs of shoes do you have if you know i can't count hey <laughs> I'm serious. i love shoes nice love nice shoes. um the first time i saw you in real life was yeah. at the miss ghana 2010 Am I correct? You're one of the judges. Judges, yeah. Right, yes. right, right, How right. was that experience for you? It was good. Offset, because you're not acting. How okay, yeah, it, it felt good. I mean, yeah, but it wasn't that easy, you know, having to, you know, judge people according to what they were wearing, what they said, and how yes. intelligent they were. Yes. But at the end of the day, I think we, the judges together, did a great job. Yes, because yeah. as a team, it makes yeah, it easier, yeah, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So that was the first time I saw you in real okay. life. And the last time was at Yvonne's Yvonne, birthday yeah, party I know, I know, at the beach. Yeah. Is this something you do on the regular going to the beach? I love... I love water. Oh, okay. I don't know if I'm a water baby. <laughs> I just love water. I love, okay. I love to swim. I love to go to the beach. Because at the beach, I really think deep and there's no much distractions here yes. and there. Yeah. I relax yeah. My first, okay, the first thing I did was actually a TV series. Okay. That was way back in 2005. That was All That Glitters. Yes. Oh, nice. Yeah, All That Glitters. All, all that glitters. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, that was All That Glitters. But the, okay. first, um, the first major movie I did was actually Shelley from Paul Manso's um, Checkmate oh. in 2010. Oh. Because after the, um, All That Glitters, I went on a maternity leave and all that. And oh. all that. Ah. Jay. Jay, Charlie, what's up? You ready? ready? <laughs> All day. You know what time it is. Oh my. Oh my. Straight up, cover the bomb. So maternity leave. Um, yeah. Did you have twins? 
No. <laughs> I'm here to have twins. I love twins. Oh, good, good, good. <laughs> oh, you're so sure. Um, how come? God will listen to Because you really prayer. want to have twins. I, I want it. Right? So, so, how many kids do you have now? No. Just a boy or a boy? A boy. Oh, nice. So, how old is he? Um, he's about eight? Five. Oh, just five? Yeah, five. When did you? I had him in 2008, actually. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah. so that. Were you working or did you go off? I wasn't shooting actively then. Um, I was just doing my own bits and pieces here okay, and there, okay. you know, yeah. But I mean, the major bounce back was in 2010. Okay, yeah. and then you said with, was that with um, Checkmate? Checkmate. Okay, okay. okay, and before that you started with the series. All yeah, that all that is. Is. Nice. What would you advise yourself? Let's say right now Karima is back at the age of 15. You haven't yet started acting, nothing. What would you tell yourself? Um, to still live under my parents' roof. Oh, you left. When did you leave? <laughs> I left, uh, you know, I mean, I, I am an orphan. Oh, okay? okay, I lost okay. my mom when I was six years and my dad when I was 15 years. So growing up, I just lived with an uh, auntie okay. and her husband. Okay. You know, so I just, I just had to, that independent life. Mm -hmm. But I think in a way it helps, but in other ways so you too. left your auntie's place at yes, a age. yes 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 i did like 16 or i left i think at age 20. okay yes, okay were you did you, you guys were not getting along or? no my auntie actually died oh no so wow. you know it just hit me to face life oh, like that okay. you know, so, so it's yeah. not like you left on your own no no i didn't yeah. i mean death 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 caused me to You know one thing I believe in, if, if something is meant to happen and it's really meant to happen, it will happen. If you want to be an actress, you don't have to leave home to pursue your dreams of being an actress. Be with your parents, make sure they understand the whole acting thing that you feel for. You know, and I'm sure parents today really want to see their kids grow up happy, so they will understand. You know, so you don't need to rush into something else. And trust me, if you're a girl and you're listening to me, you have to take your time. It's not easy being independent. It's not. <laughs> yeah, it's not at all. People yeah. say they're independent, it's, it's but then not, they're asking others for phone credit. I know, like, you know. You know one thing I always say, we all smile and pose for the cameras, but deep down, there's something pinching us. <laughs> my chick bad, my chick hood. My chick do stuff that your chick wish you could. My, my chick bad, my chick hood. I saw a big tattoo at your back. How many do you have? Uh, I have one, two, three. Hey, one, two, three, four. I think I have five. Okay, five. okay. Yeah. I love tattoos, but I'm so scared of pain. I don't even have a second piercing. It's so pain. I love like, piercing and tattoos. Hey, yeah. I pierce, I pierce when I'm really, really hurt. Wow. And when I want to do something Like fun, emotionally hurt? Emotionally hurt. Yes, pierce. <laughs> Oh, Charlie. That's Charlie. Um, Charlie is the name of my parent. Tell me if you see him. Let me just clear my throat. Well, yeah, that's, that, Ooh, that that's Charlie, or Charlie, you know? Charlie or Charlie. That parrot was very good. Yes, but it's dead. Oh. My, my chick bad. My chick hood. My chick do stuff that she chick wish she could. At the moment, I know you are in law school. Yes. How is that going? It's not easy. Deborah, it's not easy. I mean, I'm a mother, a single mother, and I'm always proud to say that. And, you know. You guys, celebrity at the same time. Exactly. I'm an actress. And I'm in school, you know, so it, it's not really easy, but I'm trying. Yeah. I'm trying. And um, how many months have you done so far? Oh, do you know I have a long way to go? <laughs> Don't worry. Oh, Charlie. Yeah. Hmm. The effort and the fact that I you're know, doing it is, I know. you know, already I something to be proud of. And the fact that I'm paying my fees myself, wow. I will make sure I finish. Exactly. Yeah. Thank you so much for Thank joining us on the It's Thank been you. lovely talking yeah. to you. I have learned, you know, a lot today yeah. and I bet they have as yes. well. Okay, see ya. Thank you.